I was punched in the back of the head with enough force to knock me over. The first sign I had been hit was a loud crashing noise and a loss of vision. I was punched by a patient in the back of my head with enough force to knock me over. She held me down, spit in my face, and punched me in the face. The patient jerked the needle out of my hand and tried to stab me with it. He literally waited for that moment to pull back and kick me in the face. She brought up both legs and tried to kick me. Being hit, pinched, my hair pulled, and punched. A CNA entered his room and punched her in the stomach. Threw the paramedic against the back door of the ambulance, going down the road at 70 miles per hour. My coworker said they heard me screaming and found him tossing me around the room. I was six months pregnant and a large male patient, 6'4", 270 pounds, chased me down the hall. He came after me stating, I've killed others and you're next. Montana experiences injuries from assault at a higher rate than the national average. That's significant because it's a 100% a workers' comp issue. This is too expensive for our employers, for our nurses, and our healthcare workers, and ultimately our patients. Right now, being a nurse is more dangerous than a construction worker. Uh, these solutions are making uh, your workplace safer. And quite frankly, it's making everything safer.